Hi everyone. In this video I am turning a uh, shallow ball from us 23.5 centimeters in diameter and uh, just shy of 5 centimeters in, uh, in depth. The uh, ash has um, very open grain and uh, is um, therefore uh, very good for coloring the uh, open grain. So I'm using um, embellishing wax both on the inside and the outside. I hope you uh, enjoy this uh, video. Thank you for watching. I'm uh, using a half inch uh, ball gouge to shape the, the bottom for the ball taking uh, light cuts, cutting with the grain, gives uh, very, very nice clean cuts. Here I'm uh, turning the, the bottom, making sure it is uh, just a little bit concave. So the ball will stand properly. Some shear cutting with the uh, ball gouts to refine the, the shape. I sand the, uh, the bottom uh, to, to grit uh, 400, starting with grit uh, 120. Then apply sanding sealer. Let that dry for a short while and then spray the bottom with ebonizing lacquer. This is allowed to, to dry properly. And uh, then I <coughs> apply white a belling sea wax, rub it uh, thoroughly into the, the grain. And as you can see, um, the open grain or the ash take this coloring very well and the grain uh, becomes very prominent. I use uh, tennis oil to um, clean off the uh, excessive uh, box. I buff the oil and try to remove as uh, much as uh, possible. Then I allow that to, to dry for uh, two, three hours and then apply high gloss uh, wax. I define a small recess in the bottom to uh, be able to uh, reverse mount the uh, the ball in in a screw jet. I make some uh, decorating stripes in the bottom using a point tool. Sand this to uh, grit 400, apply sanding sealer and uh, high gloss uh, wax. 
and otherwise leave the um, recess with a natural uh, color it makes a nice contrast to the black and white uh, color of the bottom. I use the uh, half inch uh, ball gouts to uh, follow out the ball. This part of the video is uh, showing normal speed. And I am just um, moving the uh, tool forward slowly and let the rotation of the, the piece determine the speed of advance of the tool. When I'm getting close to the final shape of the uh, of the inside, uh, I take very light cuts with a sharp tool. But even though I try my best to uh, to make clean, even cuts with the ball gouts, there are some ridges that I need to um, remove, and I use a negative rake scraper to uh, to do that and um, refine the. Uh, the inside. Here I marked the uh, two ridges, uh, ridges that I needed to remove. Final uh, cleaning of the rim using the ball gouts. I then uh, sand the piece as the outside to grit uh, 400, apply sanding sealer, and then I use black embellishing wax to enhance the, the open grain of the wood. I use a, a lot of uh, wax and try to uh, make sure that I rub it uh, properly into the grain. And as before, I use uh, Danish oil to um, 
clean off the uh, excessive uh, box. And I've uh, removed as much as I can of, of the box. Uh, I allow the uh, oil to uh, dry for a few hours and then uh, apply Yorkshire grit. And uh, two coats of uh, high gloss uh, box. We are now getting uh, close to the end of this uh, video. I hope you enjoyed the, the process. Here is a view on the, the finished uh, piece. The inside and the bottom, the outside. Still images uh, coming up uh, at the end of the video. Thank you for watching.